In earlier session, I have started topic chemical thermodynamics. In that, you studied first point introduction part. Then second point terms involved or used in thermodynamics. And now let us see third point nature of work and heat. Very interesting part. Okay, see here. This is a system. You know that. Each and every system has definite amount of energy and that can be exchanged with the surrounding. Okay, in a variety of ways. Actually, two important ways, two important modes are there to transfer the energy. The two ways are either in the form of work, that is W, or in the form of heat, that is Q. Both are path functions. You know that W and Q are path functions. Okay. Now let us see first part work. First consider what is work. Actually in mechanics the definition of work in mechanics is work is defined as an energy by which the body can be displaced through a distance d with an application of force is called as a work in mechanics question may be asked how is work defined in mechanics okay next now in thermodynamics in thermodynamics Actually, you know that there is an expansion of gas or compression of gas that is pressure volume type of work that is PV type of work. Now substitute the values of P. S P is equal to pressure is a force per unit area into this volume. Okay. Suppose if distance is D, then what is the area? Area is a D square and volume is d cube okay then now this cancel done and f into t that is pv is equal to f into t in thermodynamics now compare these two equation in mechanics w is equal to this in thermodynamics pv is this one now this side is same this is indicates that w is equal to pv is equal to f into d all are same. Okay. Understand this part. What is work in thermodynamics and in mechanics. Now let us see how system exchanges its energy in the form of this W. That is in the form of work. Okay. Now consider a system with this movable piston and weight. In this system suppose if I Take H2O2 that is hydrogen peroxide which is liquid. It is less stable therefore it is easily decomposed. Here H2O2 is taken it is decomposed into H2O and oxygen gas. Now it is a balance but oxygen disabled in the form of Diatomic. Now for balancing, therefore 2, 2 and 2. Now here what happens? H2O2 is taken. Oxygen gas is evolved. Actually, this is a liquid. But when it is decomposed, then oxygen gas is evolved. What happens? This piston moves in an upward direction. Because oxygen gas is evolved. Therefore, the piston moves in upward direction means expansion takes place. Expansion that is one type of a work in thermodynamics that is work done. Now here what happens actually this system loses its energy in lifting this piston with this weight. This system loses its energy in Lifting this piston means for expansion. Expansion is a work. It means that system loses energy 
in the form of work to the surrounding. Means work is done by the system on the surrounding. Now work is done by the system. System loses its energy. Therefore energy of the system is decreased. Therefore write the negative sign. Okay. Because energy of the system is decreased. Now consider exactly opposite case. See here another system in that NH3 and NH3 gas and HCl gas that is ammonia and hydrogen chloride gases are taken in this. That is gases therefore now at the start the volume is more. Now this NH3 ammonia combines with this HCl and what is formed? Ammonium chloride is formed and ammonium chloride is a solid. Therefore, what happens at the start? The reactants are in a gaseous state, therefore, volume is more. But now, after reaction, the NH4Cl that is solid is formed, therefore, here the piston is comes in a downward direction, moves in a downward direction. Therefore, volume is reduced. Volume is decreased. That is, compression takes place. Here again, compression in terms of thermodynamics, it is a work. Now, here what happens? In lifting this piston downwards, surrounding uses its energy. That energy is supplied to this system. Energy is given to this system. Okay. Means, in the form of compression, in the form of work. That is, energy is exchanged in the form of work. It is gained by the system. Therefore, it is a plus W. Now, here, work is done on the system by the surrounding. Surrounding, this one is surrounding, perform the work on the system. Here, work done by the system. Here work done on the system. Okay. Now see here. This converted into this and this converted into this. Okay. Now here in the form of expansion or compression energies system exchanges its energy in the form of work. But very important remember here consider or suppose during this exchange in the form of work, no exchange of heat. Okay, that is here insulated walls are there. Consider that one, suppose that one. Heat is not exchange, no exchange of, sorry, no heat is not transfer. Okay, only energy is exchanged in the form of work. Now consider another mode of transfer of energy is a heat. Let us how system exchanges its energy with the surrounding in the form of heat. It is only possible if system and the surrounding are at a different temperature. Okay. Now suppose at the start system is at a high temperature. Okay. Means now what happens? You know that at our home any system with a high temperature then that energy of that system is given out to the surrounding in the form of heat. Okay. That is temperature of this system is decreased. This energy of this system is decreased means Q. Okay. Energy is given out to the surrounding in the form of heat. Now suppose another case. Suppose system is at a low temperature. Then surrounding, that is surrounding high temperature here. Then now surrounding gives the energy that is system absorbs the heat. Okay, system absorbs the heat, system absorbs the energy in the form of heat. Therefore, its temperature is increased, its energy is increased. Therefore, it is a plus Q. Now remember here one thing, when system exchanges energy with the surrounding, 
in the form of heat here consider that work is not done here system is closed means no expansion and no compression that is system does not exchange its energy in the form of work it exchanges energy in the form of heat only okay now consider the sign conventions for work and heat sign conventions sign conventions of w and q okay consider this part no? question may be asked on this part give the sign conventions of work and heat in the diagrammatic form or with the help of diagram like this okay now consider this is a system system now consider first work and then consider heat sign convention for work first you know that when work is done by the system that is system loses energy therefore see here work done by the system here it is a work done by the system therefore energy of the system is decreased it is given up to the surrounding therefore it is a minus w and it is a expansion that is in this case the initial volume is less than final volume that is final volume here greater than the initial volume okay next now consider this case that is here what happens work is done on the system work done sorry on the system okay here energy is added in the form of work therefore here w is is positive and here compression takes place okay now consider in the form of heat when heat is added heat is added to the system that is heat is absorbed by the system heat absorbed that is plus q okay and when heat is given out by the system that is its energy is decrease therefore the minus q minus q here heat is released given out the minus q in this way these are the sign conventions for w and for heat okay now one analogy see here same here it is a system it has an energy similar to that of you know the bank in our city bank is there bank is considered as a system in that bank our money is there that is the energy now that energy can be exchanged that is given out or taken in a different ways that is different modes are there by check by demand drop that is dd or by direct cash that is all are different forms of money okay that is money is exchanged in the form of dd check cash etc okay. same thing here energy is exchanged in the form of work or heat both all are different forms of energies okay now let us see next part is the units of energy and work
So this is a homework that is question based on this third point, nature of work and hate. Questions are very simple and the answers are present in this session only. Observe the session carefully. You will get the answers of all questions. Next, now in next session, the topic chemical thermodynamics in that the theory part as well as new, lot of numericals are there. Please watch the previous video that is tricks and tips for numericals. Then it is, it becomes very easy to solve the numerical from this topic. That video is helpful to solve the numericals from chemistry.